Take a seat. So, Detective Beckett, it says here you took the captain's exam. Yes, sir. What makes you think you're qualified to be captain? My experience in the 12th Precinct has made me comfortable in a leadership position. And at What this I mean point, is, what makes you think you're even qualified to be an NYPD detective? Sir? Your job is to enforce the law, yet you have repeatedly ignored it. In Los Angeles, you investigated a case outside of your legal jurisdiction. But you used your badge to pursue a personal vendetta against Senator Bracken, crossing the line and endangering the lives of others numerous times. Sir, that man was a murderer. You withheld case information from superiors and flown in the face of authority whenever it suits you. Not to mention your working relationship with Richard Castle. Tell me, Detective, how often have you let your personal feelings for your husband dictate your actions in pursuit of a suspect? Sir, that is unfair. I never let... And when he went missing, you used your position to the great deal of the taxpayer's money to search for him, enlisting the aid of fellow detectives. And, well, you are infamous for being the inspiration for the fictional NYPD detective Nikki Heat, who spends more time on her back than she does pursuing killers. Detective Beckett, how do you expect to lead or even continue in your current job when it's clear you've exercised such poor judgment? Sir, if you would look at my record... We are looking at your record. You are not qualified for a captaincy, and in my opinion, you are not qualified to be a detective. Thank you, you can go.